In today's video, I want to tell you the easiest way to transfer your data from one phone to another phone with Mobile Trans. You all know the most annoying thing about getting a new phone is transferring the data, losing data, or your passwords and whatnot, all not transferring over, and it is very, very annoying. So I want to show you with Mobile Trans how easy it really is. Whether it's from Android to iPhone, iPhone to iPhone, you can transfer specific things, you can back up specific things, you can view your data that you've backed up, all those kinds of things, all with Mobile Trans. We can also back up WhatsApp data, we can transfer WhatsApp data, which is really, really good and very, very convenient. Let's hop into the computer, I'm gonna show you how it all works. First thing we've gotta do right now is connect both phones up. So I'm gonna connect my iPhone up um, and I'm gonna connect my Android phone up as well. They are both connected at the moment. As you guys will see now, once you get into the app, there are multiple different areas you can navigate on the computer so once we get into the app here we are on mac right now um, and we've got whatsapp transfer phone transfer backup and restore they're the main categories here first of all we've got what app transfer so if we click on that you guys will see you can transfer um, very easily you click into it and it shows you both phones that you want to transfer from so um, in here we've got the iphone to my android phone and i choose what i want to transfer with whether it's photos my videos um, and then we click start and it starts transferring it over. So it's very simple, very quick and convenient. Um, you can also flip the phones as well. So if you wanna go from the Android to the iPhone, you can do that as well. And if you've got uh, iPhone, you can do iPhone to iPhone as well. So that is very good. We've got what app, WhatsApp business transfer. So if you wanna transfer any business stuff from the WhatsApp business app, you do that as well through here. Um, and we have a bunch of other ones you can transfer as well. So there's a lot of different things. We've got Line, we've got Kick, we've got Viber, WeChat. Um, again, you can choose what you want to transfer and transfer those over. So that gives you a lot of flexibility on what you want to transfer because getting these stuff to a new phone can be a pain and it makes this a lot simpler. Alrighty, so as you guys can see here in this section here where we can transfer from phone to phone, this is the best. So when you get a new phone, you plug it into here, you have your old existing phone, it will load its data on, um, the old existing phone will load up and then you can choose what you want to transfer. So as you guys can see here, We've got photos, contacts, text messages, videos, voice memos, all the way down to apps and wallpaper and all those kinds of things, which is really, really cool. I've got none of that on my um, Android phone. So I'm just gonna choose to transfer some photos. Um, let's click into start that. And it's gonna go straight on to my iPhone without wiping the iPhone at all. So as you guys can see, there's a clear data before copy if you wanna do that. I'm not allowing that. I'm just gonna send it on over. So if I click start, you guys will see there, it's gonna start verifying um, and it's gonna start transferring it over. As you guys can see how quick it is to transfer those photos, it is all done. So it says restore complete, it's not restored. The phone is fine, but it just transfers those photos across. And I will show you guys that on screen here, the photos transferred from one phone to the other. So here it says import to phone. You can transfer data from the computer onto your phone. So if you wanna click some photos here um, and whatever you wanna click, photos, videos, messages, whatever you want here, you can um, click all them and attach them to import them on to your phone. Um, again, that is very, very convenient because you know iPhone can be a pain, especially one, once we transfer stuff through iTunes can be a lot, it can be a big pain. So doing this through this app is much easier. You can also do export to computer. So as you guys will see here, it's gonna load in some of my things and I can export it to my computer. So from my phone, put it onto the computer and very simple, very click um, friendly so you guys can see what you want to export here. You guys can see a bunch of videos I've got here. If I click on one of these, I can click import or export and it goes from the phone to the computer. Very simple. Right now, I'm going to export that and we'll see how quick it goes. Um, it should be a pretty uh, seamless experience and you can choose which folder you want it in. I'm going to put it into my desktop. Let's put it into my desktop and we're going to open it there. And as you guys can see, it's already done. So very simple, very quick, which is very, very convenient to have. We can also do iCloud to iPhone as well. So what we have to do is just sign into your iCloud here, get your data and you can transfer it from there. Very quick and convenient. So the next up, we go into the backup and restore. We go to phone backup here. We, we can back up our phone. As you guys can see, I'm going through the backup stage here, backing up my Android phone to the computer. We've got nine photos, four videos. It's in the middle of doing it. Um, and it is very quick. So it's actually a quick process, obviously depending on how many things you have on your phone. My Android phone doesn't have that many things on it, uh, so it doesn't um, take as long, but it does take a lot longer if your phone is filled up. So as you guys can see, the backup has completed now. Once the backup has completed, we go into restore here and it shows you the backup that you have done. You can view it, 
see what you've backed up here. And from there, you can restore it to a new phone if you want to. So you click the phone you want to restore it to um, and you can restore back to that. So it's very simple, very easy and um, awesome to use. Um, and it does work very, very well. That's me using Mobile Trends on my Mac for my iPhone to Android. So if you've got a new iPhone 17 this holiday season um, and you want help to back it up, or restore it or access anything like that, check out Mobile Trans. All the links in the description down below. Check it out, download it. Very, very easy to use. iPhone to Android, Android to Android, iPhone to iPhone, whatever it is, very easy. And especially if you've got WhatsApp and you want to transfer and back up those kinds of chats, this is the app you want to be using. So check out Mobile Trans. Links in the description down below. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.